I'm just um, doing a video. What? I'm just doing a video. What do you mean, oh, um? Sorry. What do you mean, um, Maya? Okay, gotta go. Kia ora te iwi, no my hoki maiki tēnei whakāturanga For those who didn't know what I just said Hopefully I left like the English translations at the bottom Over here somewhere Kia ora, welcome back to my channel, welcome to this video Um, it's been a long time, well for me anyways I feel like it's been such a long time I have, whew, I have been a little bit busy in the last three weeks with kapahaka, um, with working, um, with trying to get this out, ed out to everyone. Editing is such a b. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for your support. And I'm squinting because it's hella freaking bright. Here with me, this lighting sucks at the moment. Tamanu I wants to do its own thing. Um, anywho, I had posted it on Instagram, a few of the options that maybe you guys wanted to see that you guys may be interested in. And the winning one was, was Kapahaka. Today we're going to be doing the Kapahaka look, what to do, what not to do kind of thing. So yeah, that's it's going to be very, very quick because in my opinion there's not really much that you should do if we look back into the past which is yeah we're not in the past whatever but um they didn't really use makeup so it was just all natural literally here was natural <laughs> um, um for those who don't know kapahaka is the maori and the new how to explain what kapahaka is Yells. I need to think about that and I'm gonna wait there. So, kapahaka is the Māori term for performing arts and this is how we express our, our feelings, what we're thinking about the world, about politics, about people. So y'all know who you are. <laughs> and we do seven items. We do seven items, 25 to 30 minutes. Um, we just finished our Kapahaka, Tainu Kapahaka Regionals, which was two weeks ago, I think. Um, and we came, we placed fourth, or did we place fourth? No, we placed fourth, so that gives us an entry into the, the national competition, which is every second year around Feb, Feb March. Gosh. You know, I just perform. I don't even know when the dates are. I'm just the performer. <laughs> so if you think this may be your cup of tea, maybe not your cup of tea, um, watch it, don't watch it, whatever, it's up to you. We'll get straight into the video. So first, I'm gonna prep my face. I've already like put cream on, so we're just gonna do the next steps after that, which is using the Max Fit Plus. Ugh, Max Fit Plus, what the? Max. Mac Fix Plus. Ugh, jingos. So we're just gonna wait for that to kind of chill out, cool, sink into the skin. And now I'm gonna go on to my eyebrows. So for me, really, I'm just going to fill in like all the um all the patches, all these patches that they've got to go. I always do my eyebrows first. It's just a, it's just a habit. And I wanted to do this video because I feel like it's fitting, like Kapahaka is nearly over in June I believe, that's the last regionals and then back into it in November, you know, those are the months that usually when you kind of do a muster or whatever. I'm, not, I'm no Tudor so I don't actually know what the hell they do but it never switches off, it just carries on. Big props to all the tutors out there doing kapahaka. This could be for primary, for high school, um, for adults. You guys are freaking amazing. I, I don't know how you guys can do it. I can barely do the poi and I'm freaking out. So, yeah, you guys are really freaking neat. If you call out my name. Okay, now we're done with the eyebrows. The next bit is super, 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 super easy. I'm gonna go straight onto the face. <sighs> Wasn't that easy? 
So we're gonna use a concealer. It's almost the same color as your skin. I'm gonna use the Lay Girls Pro Concealer HD High Definition Concealer in the color Cool Tan. Now this is, I love this shade because it, uh, it just looks well with my black skin. Tap a little bit onto the skin if there's some. Come on, I know there's some. I haven't used you in a while. You don't need much, um, does that fucking fly again? You don't need much makeup when it comes to kapahaka because y'all know, y'all know how intense, extremely intense hackers is. And doing a 30 minute bracket, going handy as hell, your makeup will just sweat. You look like you're sweating anyways. Unless you're fit, then wow. But if you're unfit like me, I'm hella unfit. You just want to use a little bit of makeup. You really don't need that much. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this little blob to just kind of cover up all of my scars. That's literally it. That's all I'm going to do. Did you guys hear that? You don't need foundation. You don't need concealer everywhere. You don't need powder. And you sure as hell don't need bronzer. But that's just me. Perfect. So we're going to use this. So wave a concealer buffer brush. Ha! Then we're just gonna go and dot everywhere you want to conceal. But obviously I've got like a whole contour line <laughs> of scars there. I don't really have much on this side, so that's fine. I don't know if you can see actually, but I've dotted everywhere that I want to get rid of. So that's over here, underneath the eyes a little bit, just on this side, and two dots up the top. What we're gonna do, we're gonna use this buffer brush so there's still a little bit of product on the brush and you kind of just want to go in and go around the um, concealer <laughs> Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get a lighter concealer and kind of just brighten up this under eye. So we're going to use 1050. I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes, use my mascara, and that's basically what I would do. But like if you're a little bit extra and you can get lash extensions, some it works for some people, it makes your eyes big, it makes your eyes look natural, beautiful, and some it doesn't work. So it's really up to you what you want to do. The same thing goes for mascara, it works for some, it doesn't work. Um, if you naturally have beautiful eyes, beautiful huge eyes, you really, really don't need to put any mascara on. I guess people get caught up in the whole trend like, yeah, I need to put all this makeup on. Yeah, I, I don't know why, but there are a lot of beautiful, natural, moldy women who like to wear nothing and you look stunning. So, just before we finish, I'm going to quickly put a little bit of highlighter on. And today, we're going to use Uncle Jeffrey, Auntie Jeffrey. And this is in the colour King Tut. And 
that's really all that I would do. Um, black lipstick, obviously. Today, you know, we're gonna use this. Okay, we're gonna attempt to do <laughs> Amoko. But you get the picture, right? So, this is all that I would do. Sorry, I don't mean to take the mana of the moko. It's just I actually super suck and I was going off a picture that was drawn on me. And it's like, well, two kurus and I couldn't even do it. And if you wear a lot of makeup, it's whatever makes you feel happy. This is just my own opinion. This is what I think. Um, so yeah, don't feel disheartened because you wear too much makeup or you like to contour or you like to bake. Quickly spray. Not that I'm gonna be wearing this, but you know, I actually really love this look. I should have got a tea party. I should have put on my bodice. My tutors definitely won't like that if I put the bodice on. So um, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this. Yeah. So thank you so much. Wayorunga out.